It's the best day of the week besides mm -hmm. Friday. Yes, that's Thursday. True. Yes. <laughs> Michiana Eats. Yes. This week we're doing something a little different. In honor of Terry McFadden's retirement, which is tomorrow on Friday. It's the only time we say we hate Fridays mm -hmm. around here. Yeah. Uh, Melissa stopped by one of his all-time favorite spots. It's a piece of history in South Bend. Open since 1951. It's a favorite spot for many people to grab a slice of pizza, including our very own Terry McFadden. So today, I'm checking out Rocco's. happy to be here. You know, obviously we know Terry's about to retire, so yes. I had to come check out one of his favorite spots. I'm told he comes here a lot. Uh, quite a bit. How often would you say? Maybe once or twice a week sometimes it, it can be. Other times maybe once a week, but just depends. Wow, so you guys are pretty close with the McFaddens. Very, very close. Very close. We, we were pretty much all grew up together. I especially at same church, same grade school, same high school. But they've been coming in here with um, Victor and Bonnie for since they were born. Well, what does Terry usually order when he comes here? He, he does the pepperoni. Pepperoni, anchovies, and, and uh, of course anchovies. Pepperoni. Anchovies a big thing for his dad, too. Okay. His father loved anchovies. His brothers love anchovies. Okay, well, I can't say I do, but I'm gonna face my fears for Terry today, okay? okay. We're, we're gonna... The pepperoni helps cut the fishy yeah. taste. <laughs> Homemade sauce, obviously, right? Yes. Family recipe? I mean, yes, family recipe. Lots of cheese, yes. Okay, I see that can of anchovies. It's, I'm not gonna lie, it's scaring me a little bit, all right? They're all dead though, right? They're good. <laughs> okay. Garlic. Go Fresh garlic. That's oregano. The Terry special. We gotta do it. Terry orders it, so this is in his honor, right? This is for you, Terry. There's we got one right there on the end, so there you go. I taste the anchovy. <laughs> it's there. Yeah, it's there, all right. It is there. Strong. Yeah. A little bit. <laughs> yeah. You need some beer to wash it it's down. It's a little pungent. <laughs> Pizza's amazing, obviously, but garlic and anchovies. Okay, Terry. Is there any message you have, like, for Terry before he retires? Anything you want to say to him? Well, we wish him good luck. And he's been a blessing to us and all of his family. Yes. Have been a wonderful blessing with his parents and his siblings, and we hope many blessings come in your retirement. Too. And, uh, and we I'm know sure that he's not going to go anywhere. He's yeah. going to stay in town. So we're going to see him a lot. So we'll get to see more yeah. of him, hopefully. Oh, you will. You will. I need some gum now. Yay. <laughs> <laughs> hey. Here you go. Brush you back some, Terry. Oh. Uh, that was fishy, and yes. You see, oh. You, oh, Terry. Uh, I can smell it. I no, can listen, smell it. I, I, I get that uh, anchovies isn't for everybody. Yeah. But you got to understand the history of this. B brought up Catholic in the 60s, my parents on Meatless Fridays, the very first place I went for pizza was Rocco's. We would go to Rocco's for, for Meatless Pizza and my father would order anchovies. Mm. And so that was the first pizza I ever ate was anchovy pizza, which I was so young, I thought it was called Aunt Joey's pizza. <laughs> <laughs> and so, so when it was time to go for Friday pizza, I'd right. say, are we gonna go to Rocco's for Aunt Joey's? Are we gonna go for Aunt Joey's? And I've been going ever since. Wow. Uh, now, I, I noticed you grimaced a little bit with, with, with the anchovies. Yeah. That's not a reflection on Rocco's no. Pizza. It's, it's a reflection on anchovies. Yes. I, I just acquired a taste for it. Yeah. Yes. Kind of yeah. like Guinness, yeah. I acquired a taste for that. <laughs> yeah. So uh, what I'm saying is, is that um, Rocco's, in my opinion, Best pizza I've ever had. Oh, it's delicious. Yeah, it's, it, it's, it's great. Um, but if you're a little squeamish about fish, don't order the anchovy. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. Little side note here. Mm -hmm. Warren and Linda, uh, Linda's father, Rocco, founded Rocco's uh, first pizza joint in South Bend. Wow. Now, 
Rocco's granddaughter, Linda's niece, Gabriella, is marrying my firstborn in September of 2005. Oh. <laughs> so oh. the Rocco's Pizza Empire merging with the McFadden Broadcast Empire. Wow. <laughs> we go back to the 1950s and now two great Michiana traditions coming together. That is amazing. It's, it's, amazing. it's like royalty. It really? That's really cool. If you had Michiana it's royalty, that's It's you pizza know. royalty, I can tell you right <laughs> yes. there. Yes. Thank yeah. you. Of course. What and a terrific of thing. Of course, Terry. And I can't wait to go back because like you said, their pizza is so good. Like yeah. that was what I noticed besides the anchovies, like the, the crust. <laughs> yeah. it, oh my gosh. Out so of I this world. Them, I'm coming back. I'm not getting the anchovies, yeah. Terry. I'm sorry. But yes, their pizza is incredible. Oh, Thank and you. Terry, we know you're going to go even more like Melissa said. Now that you're retired, yeah. he'll be a regular. Uh, we just yeah. experienced the Mount Rushmore of Michiana. <laughs> That's awesome stuff. Um, Terry, thank you. We'll see both of you guys coming up at 5 o'clock. We got trending next. Yeah. I wish this was you trending. You might need a mint after you eat that <laughs> at 5 o'clock. We'll be right back. <laughs>